My name is John and I cut lawns for a living. And this is what I use to sharpen my mower blades. This is a yellow horner blade sharpener. This is a budget sharpener that produces professional results. No need to spend a fortune on a blade sharpener. This blade sharpener is under $200 and really does a great job at cleaning blades up. This blade sharpener is made in the USA, all steel construction, welded together and will last a lifetime. Really high quality product. This is a jig that grinds the blades back to the factory 30 degree angle. Giving those high quality results you demand in the commercial application. What I have here is a Harbor Freight angle grinder. This is about $15 and I have a really high quality flap disc. This flap disc makes all the difference in the world when using this setup. Really gives great results. It really cleans the blades up real nice and it hits the blade perfectly compared to a smaller flap disc where you seem to have a lot more misses when you're trying to grind the blade out. The most important thing when using this is you need to be consistent about how you draw the blade through the flap disc. All you do is you lay the blade up against the jig and you draw it through. What you don't want to do is you don't want to draw through and stop because the flap disc will burn into the blade causing damage, possibly making your blade unbalanced in an area where now you have to grind that out to get it back to the proper angle. It really does give a really nice finished appearance once you have it ground out properly back to that 30 degree angle. What I have here is a couple of Xmark blades. This first one's a Ballard aftermarket blade. This is a low lift blade. I bought this when it first came out to try it out and I put a lot of hours on it. Now the blade angle is way out there. It's going to take a lot of passes to clean up, but once it's done, it'll be back to that factory angle of 30 degrees and look great. This is a factory Xmark blade. It's really rusty and dinged up, but the blade angle is not that bad. It's fairly close to the factory angle. This will clean up really fast. Now let me show you how well the Yellow Horner does at cleaning these blades up. Just like any blade sharpener, Safety glasses are a must. This thing throws sparks like crazy. Just after making about 10 passes, the blade's cleaned up, very smooth. The factory 30 degree angle is back, ready to mow. Now let's try the Ballard blade with the worn out edge. This is going to take a lot of passes to clean this up, but once it's done, it'll be a really nice finish. I'm not finished with the grinding. It's about halfway there. I still have a lot of rust down here that I need to remove. And the angle is not back to the 30 degrees yet. This other side, I sharpened completely and it's back to the 30 degree angle. You can see how much wider the grind is on this one compared to the other side where it's still a steep angle. It took a lot of passes, but the blade's back to the 30 degree angle, ready to be balanced and put back on the mower. The Yellow Hornet comes with this very inexpensive blade balancer. You just sit the blade on the balancer. If this blade has been out of balance, it'd be heavier one end and you want to take material off the heavy end to get the blade balanced. Now the blade is balanced, ready to go back on the mower and make sure you use a torque wrench when putting the blade back on. That way you know you can get it off in the future. If you found any benefit to this video, please consider subscribing and thanks for watching.